The mesh upper grill replacement that we have here today is a very popular option for the 07 to 13 Silverado owners who are looking to go with an affordable Baja inspired replacement to totally change up the look of the front end. Now this grill will combine a durable ABS plastic build with a gloss black finish and can be had for that mid to high $100 price point. So as I mentioned at the top of this video guys, this particular grill is easily one of the most popular available for this Gen Silverado for the simple fact that it delivers a killer look at an affordable price point. Now if you've been browsing the site for a bit for something similar to this, maybe a different blackout grill option, well, chances are you stumble across quite a few, but in my opinion, this option is gonna deliver one of the cleanest looks at one of the most attractive price points in the category. But taking a closer look at the build itself, you're gonna notice a very durable ABS plastic construction for both the mesh itself and the surround, which is all one piece, by the way, and then finished off in a gloss black paint. Now the grill is designed to be a complete replacement for the factory upper grill, which I feel makes for a much cleaner look when compared to maybe a different overlay style grill. But before we get into the install, I just want to remind prospective buyers out there to check out the customer reviews along with a number of the customer submitted images for this very popular option. In fact, there are dozens of four and five star reviews to read up on to go along with some of those images, which will ultimately give you guys a better idea of what to expect once you receive this grill at home and ultimately get it on your rig. But switching gears, let's get into the install process and site's gonna call this a strong one out of three wrenches on the difficulty meter and about an hour to complete from start to finish. But to give you a better idea of just how the job will go down, here's an American Trucks customer to walk you through the job on his Silverado now. Before we get started, I'll go ahead and let you know what tools you're gonna need to do this. Uh, I have a long set of needle nose pliers for the clips in the grill a flathead screwdriver only because when i went to the auto parts store they didn't have any trim removal tools the trim removal tool is what is recommended for this you're also going to need a ratchet with an extension and the holy grail of sockets that old 10 millimeter so make sure you find that before you get started all right so now that you have opened your hood Take note, you're going to have eight of these little trim tabs that you need to pull out. Remember, like I said, the preferable tool for this is going to be a trim removal tool, but I don't have one, so a flathead screwdriver will work just fine. Now that you have all your tabs, put them somewhere where you're going to remember where they are. Keep them separated. Very important when you're working on anything to keep up with all of your materials. Okay, now that you have all eight tabs removed, you can go ahead and grab this plastic cover and lift it right off. We're going to set that to the side. next step is going to require your ratchet, your extension, and your 10 millimeter socket. There are one, two, three, four bolts that you're going to have to remove. Make sure you have your ratchet set correctly. Remember righty tighty left loosey. One. 
two. Three. All right, last one. Break it loose and spin it on out. All right, so the four bolts connecting the grill to the frame have been removed. Now we are going to compress the clips for the grill that are located inside. You have one, two, three. Four, five six of them to compress all together with the use of your needle nose pliers. Once we have pulled those out, we'll be able to slide the grill out of the front of the truck and prepare to replace it with our new grill. All right, I'm gonna start with the hardest one first over here. There's actually a little tab that I'm going to pull just so I can have easier access to the uh, clip here to compress. bottom one here has already come out. last one right over here in the corner
All right, now you're gonna need your four bolts that you took out of your drill, your ratchet, and your 10 millimeter socket. Alright, once your drill's back in place, you can reinstall your cover. So if you are looking to give your Silverado an aggressive facelift for south of 200 bucks, then check out the Black Mesh Upper Grill Replacement right here at americantrucks.com.